Am I the A for not babysitting for my sister on prom night? Our school's prom was a few weeks ago. Even though I'm a sophomore, I got to go to the prom this year because one of my best friends is a senior and she invited me to go with the rest of our friends. My half-sister was also going to go. She couldn't go to her junior prom because she was pregnant at the time. This year, her boyfriend's parents were supposed to watch her baby that night, but his dad was having chest pains, so his mom had to take him to the hospital. Our mom couldn't watch her because she was working nights, so they were trying to find someone else to watch the baby. They tried calling a bunch of people to babysit, but couldn't find anyone else, so they asked me to skip the prom and babysit so my sister could still go. My sister offered to pay me to babysit and for my dress and share of the limo eventually. I didn't need the money though and I really wanted to go with my friends. It's been a month now and she still keeps bringing it up and won't leave me alone about it. My mom also said she's disappointed in me for not helping out my sister since it was her last chance to go to prom. I still have two more chances to go. I don't think that's fair though because it was still my only chance to go to prom with my friends who were seniors. Now for the top comments. This is the reality of being a parent. Sometimes you have to give up something you want to care for your child, not the A. I have to correct you there. It's not sometimes, it's most times. And the younger the kid, the more you have to give up. I want to sleep in. I need to get my kid breakfast. I want to play video games. I need to help with homework. I want to sleep on my bed. My kid has a nightmare, so I'm sleeping on a chair in his room. If you are lucky as you get older, your kids will want to do the same things you do, or things that don't require your constant supervision and input. I wouldn't trade a minute with my kid for anything. But the reality is, when you become a parent, your wants are second to someone else's needs. OP, not the A. I'll pay you for the ticket, dress, and limo eventually. I will never pay you back. Not the A. When you make grown-up decisions, you gotta deal with the grown-up consequences. She unfortunately had to learn that at a very young age. Not the A. Would you expect her to give up going to the prom to help you go instead if something had come up for you? Doesn't matter what the circumstances are. Most of us would not expect this, and it's not the end of the world. My two proms were special at the time, but are distant and very unimportant memories now. Not the A. It's tough being a parent, and even more so if you're a teen parent. But if she made that choice, then she needs to understand she will have to give up certain experiences. Now, if you live somewhere where you have access to termination and she didn't want to be pregnant and a mom, then I'd have more sympathy. But that time has passed and she's a parent now. If you want to be nice, you could offer to babysit so she and her boyfriend, baby daddy, could get dressed up and go out to a nice dinner so she could wear her dress. But only do that if you want to. Don't let them try to guilt trip you. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this story, please like, subscribe, and leave a comment.